Hey guys! Hi. Today we're gonna be doing a thrift haul and we are gonna show you guys everything that we got and tell you our experience at being at the thrift store. I'm sure you guys are gonna wanna listen to our that. Our little findings that we found. Yeah. Jackie found more than I did. I'm super yeah, surprised. I actually found quite a few things, so I'm yeah. so excited to show you guys. I have one, two, three. 3.5 things that I found because the other one's really small. Oh my god, you only have 3.5. Yeah, so you should start with one and then I'll show another one. That way um, we can take turns. Okay, and I have there. five things. That okay, so I'm gonna just. I have like a lot of favorite things, but um, the first one that I found, I've been wanting like a blazer that I can just throw on and kind of like make your outfit pop and look really nice and like more elegant I guess yeah. or more like going out and I found this one which I don't know if you guys can see the fabric in camera but the fabric is just beautiful what would you call this fabric I don't even know I have oh no clue. and the detail here on the arm that's pretty yes nice. and it's just it the fit was beautiful mm -hmm. and I got it for $6.99 and I wish let me see if it actually says what fabric it is I'm gonna really have to take care of this because this looks like it's really it's a hundred percent polyester. Mm. I don't know if that's yeah. necessarily, but um, it's really really nice. It's Just classy when you feel like being a little classy. Well, and it's like such a pitch black color. Like I just yeah. love it. You can literally. So yeah, this is my first item that I'm showing to you guys, and it was six ninety nine. That's a bargain because normally, like I would think that those are. Not like exaggerating, probably like thirty-five to forty dollars. Yes, and this one looks like it's actually very good fabric, so I yeah. honestly feel like this one would be more expensive. So it's definitely a bargain. And okay, so I'm gonna start off with um, some jeans that I got over there, and I don't know. <laughs> no, I was gonna say I don't know if you guys have heard of boyfriend <laughs> jeans. Of course, you guys have heard of. Boy I don't know if they're mom jeans or boyfriend jeans. Whatever, they fit you baggy and tight at the top. So this is what these but those are. Those are beautiful. Yeah, they're a little tight right now, but I'm gonna work out and squeeze into them. <laughs> no, like I fit into them, but they're a tiny bit tight. Like maybe if you sit down, then you'll kind of like yeah, be a little uncomfortable. But um, yeah, they fit great. And oh my gosh, look at like the color. It kind of gives kind of like like 90s vibes you know it's like when you go thrifting and you are looking for the old levi's yes this, this is the type that it is yeah and i want some of these like the exact same look i just want them in a lighter color because i've been seeing a lot of girls wear like jeans like that kind of big on them and they look amazing so yeah i got these and they're actually from PacSun and if you guys shop at PacSun their jeans I mean if you get a good sale you'll get jeans for like 30 bucks but sometimes their jeans are like $60 so I'm like this is a bargain and I got this for $14.99 so $15 and they're in, like, they look crisp perfect like condition if, like almost like if they didn't, they didn't get worn at all it. yeah they probably wore it like Couple. no more than like four times yeah and um, they are also cropped so I like that. It gives that whole like kind of 90s vibe. I really want to um, like eventually make like a um, like a lookbook and show you guys how I wear these and how to style boyfriend mom jeans. But that's in the future. I wish I could wear boyfriend jeans. They you don't can. fit you on just my have body. To find them. Hopefully, I I just thought <laughs> of something too. I'm so dramatic, but. I don't know if you have this problem that when you try on like boyfriend or mom jeans, they tend to make your butt look really weird. At least for me, it like makes them look weird. Like it doesn't look like my butt. It completely transforms it. And this one gives your butt like a normal look. Like with normal jeans that make your butt look good, this is how they make your butt look. So Why do they make them I'm happy? Like that? I don't it's know. So weird. I hate it. Like maybe because they rise up more. I don't know. But anyway. I went on for too long with these, but these that's the first item that I got. Okay, so my second item, um, these I kind of wanted, I just literally grabbed them just to just try. I've been wanting some type of like lounging pants, but I ended up with lounging ones and I got these for $5.99 and they're from Forever 21. And okay, I literally thought I was just gonna wear them for lounging but they look really pretty like the fit is really nice 
and it's not too tight and it's not too loose it's just and they don't look like so they would nice. be see-through. No, so when I like tried them on, it was not see-through. And it, it no, was like, good. obviously, in They're the actually thick if you feel them mm -hmm. for like how they usually make these lounge Like super pads. thin. <gasps> yeah, they were really these nice. They're great. I wish yeah. I had some. And then I love the fact that it's like this so you can literally be comfortable. So it's either yeah. for lounging or just like actually to go out in. I'm going to have to kind of play around with it and see how it looks. They're like lounging where you can just wear them at home, but if you yeah. happen to like have to Find go to the, the store, you don't have to change. You don't look you know, too comfy. Yeah. Okay. Too outdid. Okay, my next item is this is actually an Adidas sweater. I always have a hard time getting like um pullovers. I think this is what you would call it, right? Well, I don't know. It's just a sweater. And it's Adidas, and usually these, like, they're Adidas. Oh, no, Nike, you guys. Sorry. It's <laughs> Nike. Um, I usually never look for brands when I go to the surf store. I just, like, get whatever, whatever I nice. like. Yeah. So this one was um, $13. And it's really cute. I'm going to try to. <laughs> it is like so nice. It looks big here, but if it it's be fine, it's a small. And what I like is like it's kind of the hoodie's different. Like you can kind of close it in whenever it's raining, protect my hair. But yeah, these usually are like way overpriced. Oh my gosh, anything like from Nike, it's over sixty dollars. Yeah, I, they're, and they hardly and have any like sales kind of or stuff. discounts. Yeah, no thanks. And too much. I was so jealous when Jesse got this because yeah, I looked at it and I was like, oh my god, it looks so nice, but it looked like it would be smaller so I'm like no yeah. it would not fit me I definitely but it looks it. so nice on yeah. you really so really is, nice I was gonna say it's my favorite one but that's a lie I love the oh whoa I love these so yeah and I already set the price so. oh my <laughs> god I'm like burping what's the problem with me Okay, okay, so my next one is a shirt that I got for $4.99 and this one definitely looks a little more vintagey because yeah, the just so even funny. the tag of it. Um, but it kind of has like that square look to it. Mm -hmm. It kind of looks very simple, but once you put it on, it just looks so nice. I can't wait to put this with the little blazer that I got. Yeah. I feel like it's gonna look so pretty. And just so you guys can kind of see, it's the squared top. And then it has like, these are a little bit thicker than usual. It looks really, really nice. So I'm so, so excited to try this yeah, on, to actually so just have it on. Yeah. So this was $4.99. What a bargain. bargain. That one, yeah, it was like a huge bargain. Okay, so my next one is, I don't know what you would call this, like a blazer? Um, okay, so the brand it's is... It's like a blazer and a cardigan, right? Yeah, it's like thicker than a cardigan, mm -hmm. but it's like the style of a cardigan, but I'm just going to call so it a blazer. So pretty, the color is like so nice. If you guys know what to call this, let us know. <laughs> I'm not sure. Um... Yeah, so it's just like that. I usually normal normally don't go for colors like these because I feel like it washes me out. But this one looked really nice and I want to wear this. Like it looks like a little like kind of you can dress it up. But the way that I want to wear it is I want to wear it with some jeans, some white shoes, a white shirt under and like Whoa. I don't know what color scarf I want. I'm already picturing that. So hopefully... <laughs> That's what I'm thinking in my head. Sometimes you think of like an outfit in your mm -hmm. head and then you actually try it on and it looks terrible. <laughs> so we'll see. And this one, I scored it for $7. So that's pretty good. Oh, and that's you can like tighten it too. That's like my blazer. Yeah. Right? You can so. dress those up or dress them down. I feel like you can never go wrong with them. I love this. And this is like the perfect shade of like a brown yeah. collar. And now that it's going to be fall it's soon, it's, I think it's going to, I'm going to be in style. Okay, my turn. So this yes. would be what my fourth item. So these last two items, I didn't purposely do it, but they're probably the best items that I got for like thrifting, I guess, because some people actually go thrifting and to get like good deals. And I don't really go thrifting for that. It's just to kind of see unique style of like clothing items yeah. and stuff that I like. Um, or it was like maybe they're not selling it this, this season, but they'll still have them like at the thrift store. Yeah. So 
And it's so weird because Jess and I never look at the jeans just because never. we're so picky with jeans. And this time and they we never went. never size. No, and then their yeah. jeans, they're just kind of like never really nice. And um, so Jess and I went this time and she found those jeans that you guys yeah. saw and then I found these jeans. So I've been wanting some semi-ripped, not super ripped jeans. And then these are kind of just from like and they're cropped the knees. Too, right? Yeah, they're cropped and um, you can kind of fold them like this. Yeah. <laughs> She'll be showing oh, both go. knees. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, so I saw these and they were just so beautiful. Like I tried it I tried them on on top of my other jeans and they look like they would fit. So I took them home and they ended up fitting me really well. It's kind of like how Jesse has hers a little bit snug, but um, okay, so these jeans were twelve ninety nine. You Those can see were it cheaper there. Than mine. Yeah, they were cheaper. Yeah. But guys, okay, so okay, I would not even know the price of these jeans. I was literally already gonna take them, but we found another pair of these jeans. Um, and those look super expensive. Like mm -hmm. for me, I feel like they were super good quality, which these are too, but I noticed them more on the other jeans. So I was like, oh my God, we should check the brand because I haven't really seen that brand and they look like really good jeans. So these jeans range for freaking $200 guys. Yeah. Like, we 200 checked bucks. online, yeah, 200, it goes from like 198 to like $260. I'm like, oh that's my expensive. god. I yeah. mean, maybe that's normal for people to buy jeans that expensive, but we usually will get like jeans that are no more than like $60. Yeah, like we like shopping at like um, American Eagle, so yeah. their jeans are like... Like with like, a good deal, you can even get them for like 40 bucks. Yeah, like 40 bucks. So I was like, oh my god, <laughs> scored. Yeah, and they're so scored. nice. They look really nice and they look super like and they're different very gently the used. Jeans. Yeah. Oh, that's good. I'm excited. Yay. That was a good buy. That was a really that's literally yeah. I feel like what you call like actual thrifting. Yeah. <laughs> Your turn. <laughs> actual thrifting. <laughs> we had like a brain fat. We're like, ugh. <laughs> Okay, so I'm all done with the clothes. I do have one. This is a 0.5 item because I said 3.5 items. And it is nail polish. So I don't know if it will. <laughs> I'm trying to cover my face. Oh, oh there no. we go. You know what? I end up holding it too close. That's why it doesn't focus. I never can focus. Yeah, because we do to, this like, and we're like, focus. Yeah, focus. It needs to be like, well, it's focusing on our faces. What is well, the you color of that? Know like what I mean. Oh, um, I think it's at the top of the little. Oh yeah, topless and barefoot. Ooh. Does that mean that you have to do that when you and wear this? And it literally this looks completely full. Yeah, and it's like I see. as you guys can see, it's like a like a pink, like a pink. neutral. <laughs> there you go. It looks gray there. It's not gray. No, it's like it's a, light, like a pink. light pink, very soft. You might need like two coats. I've never bought SC nail polishes because they're so again fancy. we don't spend like more than freaking like four dollars on nail polish. Yeah. But yeah, so we're excited and hopefully we like the color. Yeah. Oh That's my god. All I have. So you still I have I feel like I'm missing something. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, but besides these, oh. we almost had the same amount of clothes, just yeah, one more. Okay. okay, so this is my next um, big purchase. Well, no, not big purchase. Actual thrifting item that I got. Yeah. These are from Steve Madden, and they were $14.99. They yeah. literally look brand new. Like... They're actually really nice. Like when you tried them they on. They are so nice. I wish they were in my size, but they are so nice. Yeah, they're literally, they were exactly my size. The thing doesn't even have goo or anything. Yeah. <laughs> like I feel like maybe like, they didn't get the right size and it hit their toe wrong. Because yeah. they literally look brand new. It's crazy. Yeah, and I tried them on. They fit me really nice, and I can't wear, wait to try these on with my jeans and my blazer. Popping. So yeah, and Steve Madden is a pretty big brand. They have like, well, their shoes are a little bit more, not pricier. They're more affordable. They, you can actually yeah, purchase them. Yeah, they're like but, the pricey affordable, not uh -huh. like six hundred dollars shoes. Yeah. But. 
these would much. probably be like I'm assuming like 50 bucks probably but I would say like 70 because their sandals yeah. are probably like 70 and up and yeah, they're nice ones too these are really nice I literally feel like they didn't even wear them so I'm so yeah. excited I actually Score. really loved everything that I got and I cannot wait to try these on <laughs> yeah so me too I can't wait to wear everything and now we'll tell you guys like our little experience it's like a quick short story but just oh, our yeah. experience when we're at the thrift store <laughs> and um, okay I'll tell my little small part the thrift store that we go to it is very big and it gets very packed it doesn't matter what day you go what time you go it is always packed and the only thing that I can think of right now that I can complain about besides what Jackie's gonna say is um, when I drive there it is always such a pain in the ass to get parking it's parking bad. is terrible and then um, some people are like taking their time getting in their car and then they decide to Almost just be purpose. in their car and like get on their phone and then as soon as you pull away you like drive away and um, they back out it's like hello I was waiting for you like if I see that someone's waiting for me and I plan on leaving like I'm not gonna make you wait there's mm -hmm. a line so that's like the only thing that bugs me about it um, and that no one watches when they back out that pisses me off that's true yeah um, for me, my biggest pet peeve is the fact that like some ladies go in there with a mission and they like give zero F U C K because yeah. they'll literally like go up to like the little rock and then they'll go move it all oh to the side gosh. and you're like, yeah, so the ladies literally like they do not care and they no. push the freaking racks and it pisses me off. It annoys me and like I'll give them dirty looks obviously because I'm not going to like try to fight anybody at the thrift store <laughs> yeah. but it is pretty annoying but um annoying. we love it you actually get to find really good deals sometimes or like good um items yeah so it's nice to browse and then there's a lot of like different styles so and i remember sure you leave with something. Too. it kind of goes along with your story that the ladies push but there was there's ladies where you're like looking through a certain section you know not paying attention to anyone doing your own thing shopping and then all of a sudden you're like looking through the hangers and stuff and then they're like oh um sorry can I squeeze in through here and they're literally like this with you and they're trying to look at like the same shirt that you're looking at it's like if you give to actually me snatch that sure 10 seconds I will move this section will be yours like people kind of don't know boundaries and they don't know um, what's that like word manners yeah, but... Oh, personal um, space? Yes. Perfect. At this thrift store, maybe you guys experience it at your thrift store at home, but they have no idea what personal space is. And it gives us, like, we freak out. We need our space. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think that's, like, about it. Because besides that, we love going to the thrift store. I mean... I think it's fun. Yeah, it's fun. Mm -hmm. We actually had not gone in a while, and we forgot what it's like going and... Um, we like it, so we're probably gonna be doing like a lot yeah. more hauls. Besides the weird people, yeah. like I really, it's nice to just go. And it's a different type of clothing than actually going to the mall. Yeah, it's I you like find it. like unique pieces, mm -hmm. and it, it's nice. I like vintage. It. My black shirt. I don't think that even <laughs> exists anymore. I know. Like, or else, like you would have to get it from like those places, like Top Shop or something. And super like they expensive. sell like those kind of vintage looking stuff. Yeah, and you would probably get it for like. I don't know. Why am I trying to guess the price for everything? But like thirty to thirty-five dollars. I don't know. It's getting dark, you guys. Yeah. Okay. So we hope that you guys like this video. Yeah. This is our thrifting haul, and um, I thought I, I got it. a lot of nice things. So <laughs> you guys should go to your local thrift stores. Yes. Take a look around and experience it. Even if you didn't like it, it's nice to experience things. So. Yes. I agree. Let us know if you guys have any suggestions on future videos that you guys would like us to um, put on YouTube. And we are putting up videos every week, so don't forget to check in on us yes. and watch our and videos. Yes, and subscribe. And click the post notification. Keep up with <laughs> us. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.